Point of reference, the space station is 262 miles up north of the Michigan Peninsula at the time of launch. Four. Three. Go in, sorry. One. Kevin, get your attention start. Lift off of the Antares A1 test mission from the Mars at Zero Lake at the Wall Point facility. DBC nominal, attitude nominal. Power is nominal. Engines at 108% and nominal. Attitude nominal. Core pressures are nominal. Altitude 2,000 feet. 30 seconds, DPC nominal. Engines at 104 and nominal. Attitude nominal. Avionics power is nominal. Attitude nominal. Core pressure is nominal. DPC is nominal. Go Antares, go Cygnus. 4, 3, three 2, two one. 1. Come on. We have ignition. We have liftoff. And we have liftoff of Antares beginning the journey at the G. David Lowe Cygnus cargo vehicle to the International Space Station. Nominal. TBC steering is nominal. Power is nominal. Office is behaving well at this point as Antares leaves the uh, Mars pad. Zero A is along the plate. Two. One. We have ignition. Off of the Antares vehicle for the Orb 1 mission while flight facility delivering signals on the first market by service to the ISS. And Antares is on its way delivering uh, Cygnus to orbit. Voss on its way with the Orbital 2 Science uh, Research Supply Mission to the International Space Station. DBC nominal. Attitude is nominal during... 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we have lift off of Antares with the Orbital 3 mission that brings Cygnus on its third CRS mission to the ISS. Main engines at 108%. Avionics And launch team, launch team, be advised, stay at your consoles. Everyone in the LCC, maintain your positions in your consoles. In the LCC, maintain positions at your console. And as you can see, Cygnus lifting off on top of its Antares rocket on its mission to deliver supplies and science to the International Space Station. The first stage is now burning and will burn for 3 minutes and 20 seconds of flight before it cuts off at uh, just about 3.5 minutes into the flight. That provides the initial thrust to get uh, Cygnus going on its journey. Two, one. And we have ignition. Off confirmed, Antares and the SS Gene Cernan now bound for the International Space Station.
Terry's lifting off, going to launch has been initiated. And we have and we have lift off of the NG-10 mission, taking signal to the ISS. We've got engines at full power and uh, nominal attitude. Engine performance after startup looks nominal. Good avionics power, good TVC. And we have engine ignition. And we have liftoff of the Antares NG-11 mission to the ISS. Engines at full power. Attitude is nominal. Core pressurization looks good. Power systems look good. Stable operation, full power, both engines. start and lift off. The SS Kult Nachavla takes flight sight set on the International Space Station. Pitch and roll program. Three, two, one. We have engine ignition. And we have lift off up and carry for NG-15 mission to launch flight facility. Engines are at 100%. Attitude, core pressure, and vehicle substances are nominal. The SS Katherine Johnson takes flight on this, the 59th anniversary of John Glenn's Mercury flight, carrying eight. Two, one. And we have liftoff at seven carries for NG-60 mission to the Wallace Flight Facility. Engine set 100%. Attitude nominal. The SS Ellison Onizuka now on its way to the International Space Station to deliver more than 8,200 pounds of cargo. Good first stage performance so far. Two, one. We have engine ignition. And uh, the Ontario launch vehicle from the launch flight facility. These are at 100% thrust. Attitude is nominal. And we have liftoff of the SS Piers Sellers. One. Engine ignition. We have liftoff. We have liftoff of Northrop Grumman's 18th Commercial Resupply Services mission. The SS Sally Ride has begun its journey to the International Space Station. taking Northrop Grumman's commercial resupply mission 19 into orbit to the International Space Station. Controllers reporting a nominal ascent for Antares. Attitude nominal. Vehicle attitude remains nominal. Power is nominal. Uh, vehicle passing through max Q. 
the ground passing through max q.